right, the taste torque rolls on. Right now we've got the uh, Buffalo Bills Orange Blossom Cream Ale. This is uh, an ale brewed with honey and orange peel with natural flavor and orange flower ex extract added. Sounds delicious. It's brewed and bottled by Independent Brewers United Corporation, Seattle, Washington, Portland, Oregon, Berkeley, California, for Buffalo Bills Brewery in Hayward, California. So, basically what they're telling us is we don't know where it's brewed, it's just somewhere on the West Coast. Well, pour the damn thing. God. <sighs> I actually had this one before, but I don't, I don't recall it. I think it's a twist top, anyway. Oh, it is. <laughs> It looks more sophisticated. He's stressing about way. a bottle opener over here. It's a twist. It's from the uh, Brewfest glasses. Yeah, last year. It's mm -hmm. great. They're great samples. Perfect glasses. glasses for this. Yeah, no, that's yeah. It's well worth going right there. Yeah. No, actually, the the Brewfest is coming up. We'll do a, a whole episode at the Brewfest. Yeah, that's it's uh, June twenty third and twenty fourth. We'll be there on the twenty third. Yeah. Anybody wants to stop by and drink some beer too? We'll be there. So oh, yeah. be making episodes and all. Well, maybe one huge episode. Mm -hmm. One big episode, yeah. Wow, it kind of... Smells like a fucking orange creamsicle. Hmm. Not sure what to think yet. Same. Definitely an orange presence. Okay, orange I, there, I, I get... Not just an undertone. I get where people say the dreamsicle thing, but not quite... It's not... Certainly doesn't taste like a dream sickle, not that I really even figured that it would. I mean, let's face it. But no, I mean, there's there's no creaminess. Right. There's, at all. there's definitely orange. It's a beer. Still. It's a beer. Yeah, right. But there's definitely that orange. While I see what you're saying, there's no creaminess, it does have a creaminess in the sense that it goes, instead of just straight orange, it has more that dream sickly orange flavor than it does mm -hmm. just just you're eating an orange, like, or, or drinking orange juice. Yeah. Yeah, it's like it an orange is there. syrup. It's almost Flavor. like it's almost yeah. like they added a, it's maybe like a touch yeah. of vanilla or something. Yeah, probably. Wasn't there a vanilla bean on the honey? honey. That's where it is. Honey. honey. That's yeah, the yeah. creaminess. Mm. Every, everything's better with honey. Everything. I like it. It's what really good. Think, what are you thinking of giving it? Um, I think a buffalo um, grill brewery. It's better than I remember it. It's good. Well, I, you know, would it be something I drink on a regular basis? No. Uh, warm summer day or whatever? Yeah. I think a, a 6.5 to a 7, maybe. The aftertaste isn't the greatest. I, was, I think I was a 6.5. I was going to give it a 7. Um, I think a 6.5 for me. Well, I'm the harsh one tonight. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like I need to be a little harsher, but I don't know. I like... Here's the thing. I'm giving it bonus points for innovation... Yeah, a it's a little kind different. Of yeah, beer. Yeah. You don't see a lot of beers like that. I, so I, you, like, you see some that are promising to be raspberry or orange or some kind of orange. proof flavor. They hardly ever yeah, even the promote taste like it. I'm comparing this against all those beers yeah. that have those that on the bottle. Aside and from it's very mm, seven, Lambics and 7.0. Yeah, I'm giving I'd, it a 7. I'd have to give it a 7 also. It's actually better 7. than 7.0 around the board means it's. Uh, Better than 70% of beer out there, worse than 30. <laughs> that's how that means. God! That's what it means! Shut up! 7.0 from all three of us. Buffalo Bills Orange Blossom Cream Ale. Go ahead and check that out. And uh, we'll be back with more shortly. <laughs>